G'day, my name's Dave and welcome to Melbourne Power Equipment. Today we'll be going through servicing the Honda GX690 V-Twin petrol engine. And before we start, please make sure your engine is in the off position. Okay, and today we will need an oil filter removal tool, a pair of pliers, a flat blade screwdriver, and a ratchet with a 5 8 inch socket on it to remove your spark plugs. Okay, you'll also need some spare parts for your service. We sell these service kits online at www.melbpower.com.au. They're a GX690 service kit. They come with your oil, two spark plugs, an oil filter, a fuel filter, and an air filter, which is everything you need to service your Honda GX690 engine. Okay, so firstly, we will replace the engine oil. So just pull your dipstick out, set that aside. Now to drain your engine oil, you can either use one of two sump bolts, there's one here and one located on the other side of the engine to drain it out into a suitable container, or you can use an oil sucker um, such as I have here. Put the tube straight down to the dipstick. And I'll be back shortly when that's drained. Okay, that has finished draining the engine of oil. Let's pop that one back down there. Okay, and now we will fill the engine with oil. Okay, next grab your genuine Honda 10W30 engine oil out of your service kit. They come with a nice little inbuilt funnel, so it makes life just that little bit easier. Now I've already put about one and a half litres into this. They take about two litres of engine oil. And a little tip, just when filling it up with engine oil, it can fill up the rocker cover very quickly and can overflow out the top, so just be cautious of that one. Okay, and just check along the way with your dipstick. When it's full, the oil will be up to the second hole. Perfect. Pop your oil fill cap back on, and we're on to the next step. Okay, so now it's time to replace the engine oil filter. So grab your filter tool, loosen off the filter, and before you unscrew it too far, just throw a rag or a container underneath to catch any excess oil. Most of these will leak out a little bit of oil. Throw that one over there. Just wipe off any old engine oil. And your new oil filter, just put a little film of engine oil around the O-ring before you pop it on. Screw that one up. Pretty much as tight as you can get it by hand. That's perfect. Right. Okay, the next step is to replace your fuel filter. Just grab your pliers and remove the fuel clamp. Give your fuel filter a little twist and it'll come out. Your new fuel filter has an arrow on there and that is for fuel flow direction. Make sure that one is pointing towards the engine. Pop your fuel filter back in and place your fuel clamp back on. Another tip while servicing your Honda engine is to drain the fuel out of the bottom of the carby. That little flat blade screw down in there drains the fuel out of the bottom of the carby, out of a hose at the opposite side of the engine. Okay, the next step is to replace your spark plugs. So first we remove the spark plug caps. And grab the old spark plugs out. One. That's two. Okay, now we'll pop the new spark plugs in. Tension them up. Pop the caps back on. And that's it. And if you're wondering, they are a ZFR5F NGK spark plug. Okay, we'll now replace the air filter. So undo the big grey clips, pull the cover off. 
undo the wing nut on the air filter and pull the old air filter off. Grab your new genuine Honda air filter out of the kit. Secure that with the wing nut. And pop your air filter cover back on. Okay, that's it for servicing your Honda GX690 engine. Please dispose of any used engine oil thoughtfully. Um, and when you give your engine its first run, run it for 10 to 15 seconds, then turn it off and recheck your engine oil level. Thanks very much for watching today's video. Please hit that like and subscribe button and check out our socials for any specials we have coming up on our products. Thanks again and we'll see you next time.